I don't have any um, aprons today, but uh, my name is Brian Quinlan, and I am the Finance Committee Chair and Treasurer of St. Chrysostom's. Um, over the past few weeks, we've heard a lot of our fellow parishioners come up and talk about giving and why it's important for them to give to the church. But what I want to do today is briefly be speaking more on the business side of giving and discussing the finance of the church. For those who are unfamiliar with the Finance Committee, we're a group of people that meet to go over the um, finances for the church and ensure that we are being good stewards to the generosity of so many parishioners. Over the past few years, I've taken um, many opportunities to dispel the myth that St. Chrysostom's has a large endowment that funds the um, church on an annual basis. While we are fortunate to have some financial assets that produce income, that only represents about 7% of our income. And the remaining kind of 85% of our $1.1 million budget comes from the annual giving and pledges from the parishioners. So it's extremely important. Um, one of the things that does create is each and every year, no matter how successful we are in stewardship, like we were this year, we pretty much have to start at zero. And all the hard work starts again to raise the money to make sure that we are able to continue the church's mission um, of being fully alive in the world. Also, I believe it's important to know that the church is not supported by a few families, but it's the full community. And it's everyone's generosity that makes our church thrive. Last year, for example, we had approximately 170 pledgers help reach our goal of $900,000. And for that, I just have to say thank you. The other aspect of the church's budget that I've attempted to inform the congregation is the fact that a significant portion of the budget is fixed expenses, with approximately 70% of the budget going towards um, salary and benefits of the leaders of our church, who we owe so much and make this all possible. So it's vital we reach our stewardship goal, and it's important that we all play a part. For 2022 stewardship, we are looking to raise 925000 and currently, we've received pledges to date of just over 300000 from 68 families, so we still have $600,000 more to raise. To everyone who's turned in their pledge card, I just have to say thank you. Now, I know there's a lot that goes into each individual decision on making a pledge, but the sooner that you can um, commit and let the office know, the, sooner it will, the better it will be for um, budgeting and working with the numbers for this year. The one thing that I also need to know, it's quite convenient to do any pledges. We can do it on a monthly basis, a weekly basis. Um, it's all can be set up electronically online, or there's even the stewardship cards that we do have in the back. You can simply pick up one of those and fill that out. So in conclusion, kind of, I can't stress to you enough the importance of the stewardship drive here at St. Chrysostom's and your role in helping achieve that goal. But the way I look at it is, in reality, stewardship's not about fixing a building or paying a salary, but it is about being grateful, responsible stewards of the gifts we've all received from God. The tradition of giving back to God and the church comes from the biblical practice of tithing. Being grateful of the gifts we receive from God is something we can all aspire to and strive for a life filled with generosity based on our faith in God, who is generous in all things. So thank you for a couple minutes of your time. If anybody has any questions, please feel free to reach out to me directly. Thanks. Wes?